Hi there. My name is Frank Caron, and I'm one of the dedicated experience engineers from Salesforce's Experience Cloud for Financial Services Specialist team. Today, I'd like to take you through a very brief tour of how Experience Cloud for Financial Services can help you better connect your wealth clients to their advisors. First, I'd like to explain a little bit more about this exciting area of our solution set for wealth and asset management. Then we'll dig into a live demo showcasing where the solution can add value. And finally, we'll leave you with some resources so you can get started exploring this solution in more detail right now. Let's start with a level set on the problem space. Many of the wealth and asset management firms that we speak to in the financial services industry are leaders at building and growing wealth with smart investment and hedging strategies for their clients. But very few have paired that with world-class digital experiences that rival what consumers are exposed to in other contexts like retail. Why? Because most firms are struggling with the gap. The gap is the unfortunate divide that forms between the front office web and mobile experiences and the mid and back office business processes and tooling and systems that make those front office experiences valuable. Disconnected data streams, custom or legacy software that's hard or expensive to adapt, and a clear lack of insight into how clients are using those experiences and whether or not they're effective holds the entire firm back. That's precisely why we built Experience Cloud for Financial Services. Salesforce Experience Cloud is a powerful suite of tools to build integrated, personalized, and streamlined websites, portals, and mobile applications that bring together the front and back office to drive business outcomes directly from each click or tap of your clients. With these tools, we've built out a number of different solutions specifically tailored to the wealth and asset management industry for all your external stakeholders, from non-captive advisors, investors, and even employees, but of course, your end clients, which we're gonna focus on today. As a complete digital experience platform, Experience Cloud for Financial Services allows you to build a connected prospect to client experience, touching on all areas of acquisition, onboarding, service, retention, and upsell cross-sell, all while connecting the data, insights, and potential opportunities back instantly to the advisor's 360 degree view of their client. How? Well, let's dig in and look at a real world example. In this example, we're gonna take a look at a mother and daughter pair, Rachel and Julie, who have two different relationships with Wealth.com, our fictitious wealth management firm. Rachel is not yet a customer, while Julie, Rachel's mother, is. Both Rachel and Julie are going to be paired with Kim, a wealth manager at Wealth.com. Today, we're going to watch as Rachel goes through the process of becoming a customer. She's about to leave for a new job, and she's looking for options to roll over her 401k. That takes her right to Wealth.com's doorstep, and we'll see how Wealth.com's connected client portal smoothly qualifies her, helps her apply, pairs her with an advisor, helps her onboard, and ultimately gets her into a position of success in concert with her financial advisor. We're then going to see how all of Rachel's actions affect Julie, her mom. We'll see how, based on Rachel's information, the connected portal is smart enough to use that insight to prompt Julie automatically with the offer to sign up for a plan that will put both her and her daughter in a better financial position. For all three personas, there's tremendous benefit here. But let's dig in. We'll start the experience as Rachel. Now, as any good millennial does, she decides to go right to Google to get the answers she's looking for. Knowing she needs to roll over her 401k, she searches for exactly that, rollover 401k. When she gets the search results back, her first result is actually for Wealth.com, which prompts her to click through and to begin to learn a little bit more about Wealth.com's take on the rollover and how Wealth.com can be helpful to her. She's presented with a rich, visual, and attractive web experience that gives her more information about what Wealth.com is all about. It also prompts her to begin the process of providing a little more information to qualify what she's really looking for. This human-first experience prompts Rachel to provide a little bit more information in plain language. It helps her articulate her actual financial goals and using that information intelligently pairs her with a suggested offering or a financial service product based on her actual needs, 
rather than a giant list of different things that she's not sure which is the right fit. Once this intelligent qualification has been done, Rachel's actually prompted to provide a tiny bit more information that's going to allow her to return in the future and get more information, insights, and thought leadership in addition to continue her journey to becoming a Wealth.com customer. Once she logs in, she's greeted with a powerful dashboard that lets her continue the process of rolling over her 401k. She gets a little bit more pointed information that's now personalized for her and her needs and she's prompted to complete a input process of the additional details already pre-filled with the information she's provided. As she goes through this process and provides this additional detail, the application is going to be processed in real time directly through the backend systems of Wealth.com's infrastructure. With her application submitted, Rachel actually has the ability to follow along with that application. She can see the details of that application, where it is in the process of approval, and she can even make changes to it at this point in case she wants to clarify, say, her area of interest for her investment strategy. In addition to that, she can continue with a more formal onboarding and KYC process. She can upload relevant documentation, say her previous 401k details or her driver's license, so that her advisor can ultimately and successfully process her account. She can also sign as well, integrated into this onboarding process. As she does that, all of the information that she's providing in these details are being attached to her application record so that her financial advisor can see all of those details in those files and collaborate with Rachel. In fact, knowing this information has now been passed to Kim, her advisor, Rachel leaves a message for Kim along with her application as well. All of this information in these files are instantly available to Kim inside of Financial Services Cloud, but they're also available back to Rachel as well. She can see what she's uploaded, verify that the information is correct, and ultimately change the information or upload more additional information if she needs to. Now in this case, with her application done and being uh, excited about this process, she decides to continue and go right to book a meeting with Kim. Now, as Rachel is a millennial and on the go, and we're still in the recovery phase of COVID, Rachel decides that she's going to book this retirement planning session online. She wants to do a video call. Thankfully, Wealth.com's portal is able to take her through a seamless process to help her find the right time to meet with her advisor. This information is pulled right from Kim's calendar so that Rachel has the ability to ensure she can get that information and the hard work of coordinating everything is done for Kim. Rachel can provide a little bit more information about her goals in the meeting and then she can go ahead and book the meeting. When she's done that, she's able to return back to her dashboard and see that Zoom launch when the time comes for her to attend that Zoom meeting all integrated into the experience and presented directly to Rachel, even before she's fully become a customer. And just like that, in just a matter of minutes, Rachel was able to go from completely unknown prospect to qualified and captive potential customer. Now let's fast forward a little bit. Let's move into the future where Rachel has completed her onboarding and become a customer. Rachel, now with that same dashboard, has the ability to view her assets and see the progress of her investment growth. She can dig into the details of where her actual growth is based on the returns, and she can even use intelligent tools and calculators to begin to forecast some of that growth if she makes different changes. But admittedly, all of this is a little overwhelming for Rachel. Thankfully, Wealth.com provides her with all kinds of useful knowledge and information that she can use to learn in addition to getting served by the company. Sadly, this still isn't helping her. She's still a bit confused, but thankfully, she has the ability to begin to work with Freedom, Wealth.com's bot. This intelligent bot is there to help her every step of the way and do everything from provide guided insight or light advice to creating a case on her behalf that her advisor can follow up with uh, in the future. 
In this case, she decides to do this just that. With freedom, she files a case asking for clarification and understanding around her IRA and how that IRA growth is hers to own and control. By providing a little bit more information, Freedom is actually able to take all of the insight and automatically create the case for her. That case will end up in Kim's inbox inside of Financial Service Cloud where she can manage it as any other case. However, in this particular instance, Rachel really wants to talk to Kim right away. So she asks Freedom to connect her to Kim directly with a live chat. Now on Kim's side, inside of Financial Service Cloud, Kim sees that prompt from Rachel to chat right away. She's able to respond in real time and jump right into that chat context because she was available. Here, Rachel and Kim can go back and forth with Rachel providing a little bit more information to Kim on what she needs. In real time, Kim can see that chat come through and use all of the information of the 360 degree view of Rachel that she has available to her directly in context. Like Rachel, Kim too can reference knowledge articles and perhaps find a different article that she can present to Rachel to help Rachel find more information. All of this knowledge is available to both parties to help them be successful together. Kim also has the ability to look at Rachel's complete profile to see her life events, her details, and everything related to her account information. She can see the application that Rachel previously submit, and she can actually collaborate around that application back to Rachel so that Rachel can continue to work on that application in parallel. Kim can also see the documentation and the files that Rachel uploaded, and she has the ability to also review other things like the appointment that Rachel made. As she sees that appointment and understands the context around the ask, Kim thinks, oh, this is a great opportunity for us to actually talk in more detail, and during that appointment, I can explain a little bit more about the IRA. So knowing that that appointment is there, Kim is able to respond back to Rachel and say, hey, we have this appointment booked, let's chat then, we'll make sure to talk about the IRA. While she's doing that, Kim also sees that there's a suggested action, potentially offering up to Rachel the opportunity to discuss mortgages as well. This natural upsell opportunity makes what was a simple chat interaction incredibly powerful. Kim is able to be more efficient in her day and provide not just the answers that Rachel was looking for, but other opportunities to grow her wealth and to bring more business into wealth.com. This is a great example of how the connectivity between the front, mid, and back offices can drive incredible outcomes through the connected portal for wealth.com but really for both parties as well. In this vignette, we've seen how the Wealth.com portal can create a better connection between Rachel the client and Kim the advisor. But Rachel is only one of the people involved in our story today. Let's not forget about Julie, Rachel's mom. Julie, as an existing customer of Wealth.com, through her Wealth.com mobile application, actually got a notification when Rachel signed up. Because the portal was able to tie together the information of Rachel and the information of Julie, that relationship was able to be surfaced up to Julie directly. She was notified that Rachel had signed up for an IRA. And that same data connectivity within the family allows the mobile application to proactively suggest to Julie an offer based on the relationship between Julie and Rachel. Here, because of Rachel's status as her daughter, Julie is prompted for adding an insurance policy for her family. Her information is automatically filled, and so too is Rachel's as the beneficiary of that plan. And just like the process we watched Rachel go through, the same is true for Julie on mobile. She can provide more information, she can upload documentation, even taking a picture of her documents with her phone, and provide that information right back to Kim in the context of this policy application, just as we saw with the IRA and the 401k rollover. These are not two different tools. These are not two different pieces of technology or two different dev teams or two different investments. These are all one and the same. Experience Cloud for Financial Services is powering Wealth.com's connected client portal and mobile application. 
and that connectivity drives incredible outcomes and value for all of the stakeholders involved. From turning the relationship between advisor and client from transactional to collaborative, we see a substantial improvement in customer satisfaction, as well as an increase in conversion rates with our ability to more intelligently nurture and qualify potential clients. We are also able to use the data to drive from customer service to customer creation by being smarter in how and when we recommend upsell and cross-sell opportunities based on the specifics of each client and the relationship between members of a household. These are all great ways of showing how Experience Cloud for Financial Services is an integrated, personalized, and streamlined way to deliver a powerful and productive client experience that generates benefits for all involved. There is so much more to talk about here, but we're really excited to invite you to speak with your account teams and start working with us to define what that next generation client experience can look like. We have tools and trail mixes available for you to go hands-on right now, and we're ready to help you in partnership build a better client experience for your business. Thank you very much for your time, and we're looking forward to working together 